to have events like this um, in cities like Hull, especially because it's up north um, and it's sort of we're sort of moving away now from that thing where it's like, oh, to be successful you have to go to London. That's just not true anymore. Um, and I think it's really great that lots of people are networking and getting to know each other um, and sort of building that bigger community as well as in a city like Hull, like further afield. It was important for me to volunteer at 53 Degrees North because it's an industry that I'm really passionate about and that I really want to grow into and um, I have sort of the basic skills and the basic knowledge to get me started but it's the personal stories and the personal connections that I needed to really progress to get a realistic idea of what's out there for me. I came to talk about how in the modern music industry artists can truly develop a career from their bedroom. The, the advent of digital music has really meant that you no longer need the, the old school music industry, you know, the infrastructure of labels and so on. You can make music in your bedroom, you can release music from your bedroom. like 53 degrees north I think are really important because it's all about encouraging representatives of national trade bodies and major industry companies to come out of London and to share their expertise and knowledge with up-and-coming talent in Hull that might not usually have access to those people. We're going to be looking into ways in which artists can forge their own careers in the music industry, taking control of their, uh, of their career without the need of external factors, whether that's a label or press agents or whatever, but just looking at what resources are out there for them and how they can have a career on their own terms. In a way, what's been really good is the last few minutes since the talk when I've been able to chat to people and I didn't really chat to people beforehand because I didn't get a chance and, um, and then you know since I've finished the talk it's been like you know people are just coming and they've got their aspirations they've got their hopes and um, it, you know I hope that I've been able to sort of give them a little bit of direction or a little bit of you know belief that they can do what they you know that what they're hoping to do in a way but and, and I guess that's what the conference is, is here for, is to try and give people a little bit, bit of you know, guidance, encouragement, belief, um, you know, operational support, you know, um, intellectual support about being willing to go out there and do it. This is the first time we've done this and the weeks leading up to this people have already been tweeting from the industry saying this could be the North's great escape, this could be the South by Southwest of the North of England so for us I mean that's the, that would be the dream really is about this becoming a really important industry day in everybody's diaries and you know to everyone to get to Hull every year to 53 degrees North but also for me it's about the in-between of that so between now and next year how do we keep that going, how do we keep the legacy going but how do we also have um, um, smaller events that link into that and smaller development days where people can come and carry on having them conversations. Yeah.